I'd always drawn, so by the age of 11, I knew I wanted to be an illustrator. That's all I wanted to do. So uh, after school, off to college, then into the world of uh, book publishing. So I started out as a children's book illustrator, did that for a couple of years, became a political cartoonist, was a freelance illustrator, then went into advertising, had quite a, a long career in advertising, as from a finished artist to an art director, up to a creative director and also a writer. But now, nearly 30 years later, I'm coming back to my first love, which is illustration and children's books. As far as my style goes, I think, if you had to sum it up in one word, it would be quirky. And then if you had to sum it up in two words, it'd be quirky and humour. So I always try and get a lot of, I think a lot of interest, like there's, there's an intellectual component to, to my illustrations. It's not just a pretty picture. There's always a bit of a message in there. For me, the absolute essence is a pen and paper or a pencil and paper where you're unconstrained by any other things. You don't have to think of whether the computer's on or, or anything like that. It's just the pure connection between your brain, your hand, and the paper. I, I use a lot of different pens. I've probably got about 150, 200 different pens in total, but I have a new favorite at the moment, which I'm really, really enjoying using. And that's this one here, which is, which is made by Pfeiffer, and it's called, um, it's called a U-Rite. And the thing I really love about it is well, I can show you here, it's, it just feels fantastic, it's great in the hand. And I think the best thing is it has a non-toxic tip and has a refill. So I know that I don't have to chuck away the whole pen, I just um, unscrew it when I run out, put a new refill in and away I go again. It's um, probably one of the better pens I've ever used in terms of the ink flow. Like it's got a fantastic gel ink, very, very dark colour and it's just incredibly smooth. It's really fast to use and it doesn't, um, it doesn't smudge. So I can, I, I can re really work anywhere in the paper without having to worry about, oh, am I going to smudge the line work I've just produced? So for me, not only is it a really comfortable pen, but it's a really good high performance pen that I know is non-toxic and I just love the way it's recyclable. I really, really dislike throwing pens away. And with this one, I just keep on using it, pop in another refill, and away I go. I mean, I illustrate across both mediums. The, the, what I call the real medium, which is pen and paper and brush, and the digital medium, which is replicating those things on an iPad or on a computer. I certainly start in the real world, bring it into the digital domain, and work on it from there. Because you, the, you get the best of both worlds. But I think it's really important to have that expression in the line and have that beautiful, tone and texture you get from something done by hand.